How many times in a day do you think about your future? And how many times does this thought bother you that being a bioscience professional, you might not get the right job in your field and it might not be high pay enough? And how many times does this thought make you grab your system and search frantically for a job? Well, if you have been doing that lately, then let me tell you, your search is over. Hi, this is Debharati Banerjee from Biotechnica and in today's video, I have brought an opportunity for you on the table. Let me tell you that government organization MOEF and CC are hiring for a high pay post of life sciences consultant. Let us move on to what are we going to discuss exactly in this video. So firstly, I'm going to tell you about the post that you're going to apply for. Next, I'm going to tell you why you should apply for this post and what are the benefits that you're going to gain after securing a job position here. Next, I'm going to move on to the general conditions for application and then we are going to discuss the remunerations. Next, I'm going to move on to the eligibility criteria that one has to meet in order to secure this job position. And lastly, I'm going to tell you about the application procedure. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. So coming to what is this post is about. So the name of the post is going to be consultant B as you can see in the screen. The number of vacancies is just one and the most eligible candidate would be selected for this post. The age limit for applicants has to be 40 years or below and the duty station is going to be at New Delhi. So let us move on to why you should apply to this job and what are the benefits that you're going to get once you secure a job position here. So this goes without saying that you're going to gain an hands-on experience working in the industry. And you're going to work with the higher officials of this organization who are much more knowledgeable and skilled. So, along with gaining an hands-on experience and working in the industry, getting insights of the industry, you're also going to enhance your knowledge and skills working with higher professionals. There are also the benefits of working with a highly reputed organization like MOEF and CC. Just think of your reputation and where you will stand in your industry once people know about your experience in this organization. There is also access to undisclosed information. So every organization has some information that is not available to the general public. But being an insider, you will get access to all such information. But that does not mean that you can use this information wrongly and exploit it in a wrong way. So you have to be true to yourself as well as your organization. So, along with knowledge, skills, experience and reputation, you're going to gain some moral values as well. And obviously, the cherry on top is going to be the great monetary benefits and the performance-based increments. Let us quickly go through what are the general conditions that is needed to be met for the candidate to be eligible for this job. Every job has some general conditions and formalities that has to be done in order to secure a position. So let's move on to what are those for this job post. So the posts are going to be completely contractual and the appointments are going to be temporary. So according to the divisional heads decisions, your employment could be terminated based on your performance as well as attendance. The candidates have to be only of Indian origin and of or below 40 years of age. There are some required documents that are mentioned in the link given in the description below which you have to check out and submit in order for your application to be approved. Next, let's move on to the remuneration. So as I said earlier, it is a high paid job. So the salary is going to be of rupees 80,000 per month, but there would be no allowances. No travel or DNS allowances are included but there is going to be 8% increments annually in your salary. The working hours for every employee is going to be same as any other government employee in this organization. So working for extra hours or working on holidays such as Saturdays, Sundays or any gazetted holidays is not going to gain you any extra remuneration. 
let's quickly move on to the eligibility that is required for the candidate to be met in order to secure the job position. So, you have to have a master's degree in environmental science, life science, or any equivalent subject from a recognized institution. And you have to have a minimum five years period of experience in GIS. Also, as I said, the candidates have to be of Indian originality and of 40 years or below in age. Let us move on to how you can apply for this job. So firstly, all you have to do is after watching this video, you should check the link given in the description below. You will find the annexure one there and all the details are mentioned in there only. You will have to find the enrollment form, fill it and also submit the required documents along with it to the given address. So after watching this video, do check out the link below in the description and apply for this job. Hurry up because the last date to apply for this job would be 12 January 2022. And don't worry if you're watching this video after the deadline has passed because we always have something for you. Download the Biotechnica official app and stay alert about latest job, exam alerts, admission alerts, internships, scholarship, CSI and net and gate coaching and much more. I'm sure I have been able to help you a little bit with the information that I provided in this video. And if so, go check out the Biotechnica official YouTube channel for much more. Subscribe to the channel to stay updated about whenever we post something. Thank you for watching this video and meet you in the next one. This is Debharati Banerjee saying goodbye.